because I don't want to get the idea to save anybody. Um, okay. So I, I saved at the start of the battle, so I don't even know how he, I didn't even realize he died. Or I didn't realize he was close to death. In fact, I don't know what the fuck just happened. Okay. For the next I would recommend you keep the yellow units away from the fighting. Any save states? I'm not going to save state through the battle. However... I'm curious. If I skip a turn... Okay, so they're going to move away. They're going to move... Okay. Yeah, we already we already read this. We're gonna skip through it. And then there's Nephany. I want to attempt this stealthily, and it's kind of weird. Is he going to come back around? Reset go? Yeah. Technically, we died, even though we didn't reset the whole game. It's kind of like a death counter. Maybe I'll rename it to death counter. Makes a little bit more sense. I'm curious. Because if that guy comes back that way, we gotta like kind of hide. Okay. So the patrol pattern is pretty simple. I know I just wasted like a few turns, but I wanted to get the idea. Sixteen plus sixteen, thirty-two. I still can't believe I did that. I was busy talking to chat and I just looked away and all of a sudden Ike was dead. God damn it. Also clear up, thanks for the 100 bits, but fuck. All right, Danimal, you kind of look like an Agent 47 buff guy. Hey, she dodged this time. Sweet. Okay. Um, 16 is better. Oh.
Last night I watched a guy play the part one end game chapter of Radiant Dawn four times over two hours. Only to have Mykea. I think it's Mykea died to the boss. Sorry if I pronounced that incorrectly. I am I do not know Radiant Dawn at all. In fact, I don't even know how I'm gonna get it to work. But I'll try. Micaiah. Okay, Micaiah. That's literally what I'm doing. <laughs> Flareon, you're running it on Dolphin too, right? How does, uh, how does it run? Like, is it running okay? Except I'm playing super slow because I keep stepping away. <laughs> He's not very good at the game, and it's a hell of a thing to watch as someone who plays these a lot. What would you consider me? Probably a noob, right? <laughs> no, but seriously. Like, am I actually decent? Like, I feel like I make stupid mistakes, but... I think I do okay. I hope. Runs great. And, uh, even on an i3 laptop? No way! On an i3 laptop, it runs okay? You're a noob. But you're still looking at- you're observing information. Alright, I'll take it. Okay, so what happens if I try to break the door? Oh, that's got a lot of health. Fuck that. I would rather not. I would rather not do the thing that you just told me that I could possibly do. This guy wasn't even looking at the battle menu when starting fights. He was getting through cat chapters of pure luck. Oh lord. I think I'd rather watch someone's first play of the game rather than their tenth. Yeah, I feel like noobs are entertaining in a way. Not speaking on my behalf, but at least like watching some new like blind playthroughs are really fun. Even like people's reactions is you know, like my reactions to this game when it, when we go forth is gonna be pretty wild. Excuse me, you do not fuck with the bungo blade. Look at that pinky goodness. I could have swore I had Ike at over half health. I don't understand how he died. It's 50-50 for me. I like to watch a competent artist at work. Watching someone... Excuse me, watching someone like obliterate half of the world, yeah, can be fun, but I feel like it gets old at a certain amount of time. So instead, what we do is we uh, watch the noobs and we pretty much help them be better at things and stuff, right? I like new gameplay and really in-depth discussions of units. Yeah. I mean, I'm still kind of cheesed because, uh, you know, Fire Emblem, or Fire, yeah, Fire Emblem Warriors, like, Three Hopes came out. And, like, I've, everybody's been recommending me to get it. But, like, before that even, like, was announced, really, there was a leak for, like, another Fire Emblem game that was, like, a mainline. And I was kind of, or like a remake, sorry, not a mainline, and I was like really excited, and then we didn't hear anything, so now it's presumed to be next year, but then God knows if it's actually going to be a thing, or if it's just a fake leak. Like, I'm looking for some more Switch, 
switch emblem, you know? I did see those leaks. I believe it was uh, like a genealogy slash Thracia. Like people wanted it to be. I cried when I saw three of the Three Hopes trailer. Cried in a good way or a bad way? I have that much attachment to three houses. Hey, that's a good thing. As long as it's a good attachment. Twenty HP. She's the last level Nay. I would love a genealogy remake. I've never played it, honestly. But it's it's on the list. Like I want to play through most, if not all, the Fire Emblem games on stream. It'd be fun. I'm gonna wait. What? I tried to start FE4, then I saw the advanced combat menu. <laughs> Come on. It can't be that bad, right? It's a Super Nintendo title, so the controls are a little rough. I mean, as rough as they can be for a tactic based RPG kind of thing. Okay. I just don't like looking at it. You don't like older graphics, Clarion? Are you, are you, uh, you like, you know, more refined? It gets more refined as the series goes on. What is everybody's, like, absolute favorite Fire Emblem moment? I mean... I think that's kind of a loaded question because obviously you can't really spoil much. But my favorite moment is um, honestly the moment um, where you, you you chose the what do you call it? You chose the uh, Black Eagles, Black Eagle House, um, and you realize that you can actually you know betray the church you know the the, the, the whole thing like that was like my second or third playthrough so i was astonished i was like i can do this by the tearing their way out of zaharas that was a really oh man i love that moment i think honestly that was probably one of the best moments i've ever seen in my life like, game-wise. First thing, the part two ending animation. Oh, uh, if it's Radiant Dawn, I can't wait. Because I've been getting a lot of people being like, yeah, you should play that. And here I am, finally playing Radiant uh, Path of Radiance. Um... That was a hell of a thing. All right. Well, we'll make sure that we get into the Radiant Dawn game next. That's probably gonna be my next solo play game, so. I mean, hell, all of my Fire Emblem fans are already gonna be kind of off the charts me playing this, so. Hmm. And I'm back from my dreams. Fury, welcome back to chat, man. How you doing? How you doing? What was the button? Options. 
normal fast. Let's see how much how much better fast can make us. Makes it much better. Imagine your keyboard shakes with rumble too. The three houses cutscenes didn't look so great, but some of them impacted me. They were really impacting, impactful to me personally. You can also turn off combat animations so they only appear on the map. Uh, I see, said the blind one. How does Knife Boy go? Can do two damage, bro. Chip damage at its finest. Well, that's okay, because we got the Bung Blood. The Bungo Blood. You do not fuck with the Bungo Blade. Do -do 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 -do. Don't fuck with the motherfucking Bungo Blade. Yes. All right, weapon leveled up. Let's go. Yeah, the mat that makes it much faster, honestly. move out of spawn area and we'll open the door I think the combat animations are fine it's just I'm not looking for like an overly quick experience but just quick enough I've been on part one in the game since the beginning of stream. Oh lord. It's a long map. Yeah. I haven't reset. I've just been killing, idling for hours. Oh, Lord. Is it really that long? In your first time out, it's fucking hard because all your units are dog shit. Oh, Jesus. So you guys are making me kind of fearful for that endgame. game. 
A normal may take me 45 to an hour to finish. If I'm doing it the way I want to, no losses, getting all the items, making sure the walls don't steal XP, that sort of thing. Making sure the walls don't steal XP. I just now use my brain to solve, brain a lot to solve a mystery in a game. It was amazing. That's probably why I slept longer than usual. Fair enough, fair enough. Speaking of mysteries, I actually, uh, recently thought of getting into the mystery, er, mystery, uh, the, uh, Phoenix Wright games. And it's not really mystery in a way, but like, you know, puzzle. You know, like, solving cases and stuff. I find it'd be interesting. Phoenix Wright, and I've also just delved into some, like, uh, what do you call them? Like, indie RPGs, if anything? Indie JRPGs? There are a couple of units you can get the, at that part of the game that are almost impossible to damage. If you take weapons away from them, enemies will attack them with no drawback. They become living walls. Ah, okay. Let's get Volk over here, reopen this. But you can easily let them rip through the map, stealing away all the XP from the units that actually need it. Right. Oh yeah, I've seen all the Ace Attorney games, except for the great Ace Attorney too. Yeah, no, I've never played one. I, I, I don't know. I've been the 3ds shop was kind of you know it's closing and I saw a few of them and I'm like you know what they're on sale. Might as well just you know be a little patient and then eventually just you know yoink them before they go away. Okay, got that frag back. So you think that I should keep the partners away. So that's what I'll do. Remember when Matematicus and I would offer you to buy some Fire Emblem games? Oh, good times. Oh, yeah. Oh, motherfucking yeah. Alright, we got Nafini now. Nafini! And I apologize for- Did I just- <laughs> Did I just push the person I just met into the wall? That is abuse! Oh, God. That is painful. I am very sorry, Nafini. Jesus. If only I knew that Ike was so abusive. Wall, <laughs> Wall check, motherfucker. Yes. Oh, God. <laughs> that was an amazing moment. I think that may deserve a clip, even. Steel Exodus. That was not abuse. It was a tactical push, so the prisoner is not in the enemy's range. <laughs> Whoa! Hello! Titania! Out for revenge for the fucking uh, knight who fucking completely obliterated my Ike. Or the uh, soldier, rather.
Death? No. I'm assuming the Steel Spear would be the best bet to go. Or the Steel Lance, rather. Mend your health. Did we call it tactical abuse? Just thinking of creative names at this point. Should probably heal like two, or else I'm gonna have another post traumatic stress moment. So he chose to heal. Titania can wrap this up, I'm sure. I thought Vantage was a half health thing. Was it? Am I? Is it not in this game for some reason? All I can say there is asking you shall receive. I did receive plenty. Plenty of boon. A few streams ago, Mia used Vantage. Yeah, but isn't Vantage normally like you have to be below half health? Oh, I mean that you asked for a clip and I posted a clip. Perfect. You don't even have to. I don't even have to ask for it. You guys can just do it. Just do it. You know? Mia yeah, deserves the final kill. Vantage always procs in this game, regardless of health. Fair enough. So it's more overpowered than, you know, the future. It's a little broken. A little bit? Just a teensy weensy. I want the chests, so um, if you excuse me, I'm gonna fight the boss and shit. Now, do I need to have the uh, units escape, or are they fine where they are? I'm assuming it's the latter, but I want to make sure before I do anything. Yeah, it's a little broken. Someone made a tiny crack in it. Just a tiny crack. Once Ike escapes, everyone escapes. Okay. Vil, keep that in mind. 
That is a beautiful level up, Titania. Yes, Deno Mill. Very creepy bald guy. At least he's a oh I forgot that he is a steel blade of death and destruction and all that. Four health should be able to chip him off, right? Ah, oh, yes, excellent. What a defiant stare you have. You're exactly the type of prisoner I long for. I will watch as hope fades from your eyes and reveal us the despair clouds. Your vision, it will be transcendent. No count on it. I may have gotten stabbed by one of your men once, but not twice. You'll not escape. I will see all of you dead. You will be executed. I just drunkly fat fingered my save state away. Wait, you lost your save state? Please tell me you had a backup. I always make two, just in case. A master seal! You know, we were just talking about this. Let's start cracking open chests. We got a javelin. Counter. Back to part one endgame. Oh, Jesus. Um. I know. We got a short axe. I did not mean to... That's actually kind of annoying. Did not mean to do that. Does anyone else have a chest key? Ike does. Trade. Give me key. when you have an item that instantly makes you stronger without doing any training whatsoever. Yes. Yes, we do. Okay, how do I... Chest. Nice. Did Volk appear yet? Oh, he's here. He's just hiding behind Titania. Escape. Time to get out of here. 